Welcome to the Double ACS Daily News. Visitors to the Attleboro Arts Museum may notice a new mural on the building wall. Two artists have been working on the project over the last several weeks, and we spoke with the organizers to learn more. Hi, I'm Mim Brooks Fawcett, Executive Director and Chief Curator at the Attleboro Arts Museum. This is a mural that uh, came to be thanks to a gift from the Volterra family. So um, to give a little background to this, about 10 years ago, Max Volterra, who was uh, a wonderful community leader and supporter of the museum, had mentioned to me on his way in to visit one of our exhibitions that uh, this wall behind me looked a little barren, a little bare. And, uh, and he was right. Uh, fast forward 10 years or so, uh, there was an opportunity that came about, sadly because of Max's passing in October of 2022, uh, and his wife had said that the family, Volterra family, was interested in presenting a gift to the museum, but would leave the form of the gift up to us. And, um, and that's when it hit me, that I could make Max's comment come to life. What was important was to have this mural contain the essence of Max Volterra, but we didn't want it to take the form of portraiture. Uh, we didn't want it to be a tribute in that way. We wanted it to represent what Max stood for, uh, which was social equity, um, um, community, and also his belief in the power, transformative power of art. Max had these very round, iconic glasses, dark glasses that he wore. So um, the form of the idea was having Max hold his glasses, but through his lenses, everything would be in vibrant color. How y'all doing? So I'm Take One. Uh, that's my graffiti name. People call me Wieso. Um, originally from Boston, living out here in the South Shore now. When you step back and you look at it, the, the color in the mural is focused on the set of glasses, um, this very distinct set of glasses. And the whole concept behind that is, you know, if you focus on art, everything's a little bit better, right? Like for me, art is kind of like that uncle that you have come to a, a barbecue and you don't know he's missing till he's missing, right? But he's the one that makes it always better, right? That's what art is. Art is that, that experience that just makes everything more colorful, more bright, more vibrant. And um, in every fashion, right? If, you, if you're a cook, painter, carpenter, whatever you are, when you have the art in it, it just comes out that much better. And um, the focus is also on these young people because they are a future as an artist from a communities of color. Uh, community is very important to me and my team, and so we always try to represent that. Uh, my name is Hanado Ortega. My artist name is Go5. So the world is black and white, and you choose to see the colors of the people of life, and, and that's pretty much where it's through those glasses. You can see the color of people, the beauty of people. We wanted to represent as many cultures as we could um, with the space that we have. So uh, we have an African-American young lady, we have uh, a Latino young man, we have a Native American young lady, and then we have an uh, 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 American kid from, from all, from Attleboro, Taunton, and Roxbury represented on the wall. Um, the young lady on the right is uh, my daughter, um, and most of these kids are people um, that I know. So it's kind of cool to be able to see them, see their faces on the wall.